The episodes in this series will talk about the different types of self-care and how to integrate that within your beauty routine. So it will be divided into three, ep not six, three episodes. Hello, hello, Kayla here from Chloe Beauty and I have a very exciting video for you guys. We're not going to be doing any product demos, any product reviews. We're going to sit down and have a nice little chat. So get you some tea, get you some coffee, a nice little snack and get nice and comfy. So you may have noticed that our flyers for the past couple of months have had flowers on them. This is the actually the first time that we've ever done this before. We really wanted to encompass the idea of blooming and growing, especially the past couple of years. It's been so trying for all of us. So this is our flyer, Live in Love. Um, February obviously is the month of love, Valentine's Day, all that good stuff. So we really wanted to embody that in this flyer. And because this only shows you the products that we carry, I wanted to sit down here and really expand on that idea of live in love. Just in case anyone was reading it and they're like, hmm, what exactly does this mean? Living in love is pretty much implementing love within your everyday routine, whether that be towards yourself, your partner, your friends, your family, or even a stranger walking down the street. Living in love also relates to loving the world around you. So you just overall have a good mood. You're very positive, very happy to just be alive and just be present. And of course, the idea of living in love can be broken down, expanded in so many different ways. And I'm sure you guys probably have your own definitions of what you think living in love is, and you probably have your own current practices that you do to essentially help you live in love. Now, obviously here at Chloré, we specialize in beauty, aesthetics, so we'd like to integrate that into the idea of self-care and to get rid of the ideologies of self-care being selfish or vain, especially when it comes to your physical appearance and pampering yourself, whether that be for my ladies who we like to get our nails done every two weeks, like to switch up their hairstyles every so often, because it just makes us feel good, makes us feel beautiful, and there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. Now this video is actually going to be the beginning of a series. I'm not going to get too into detail right now, but we are beginning a self-care series. Our goal with this segment is to give you a new outlook, new point of view of what self-care means when it comes to beauty and to educate you, give you new tips and tricks so that you can implement it into your everyday routine. Obviously here at Corey, we specialize in beauty and aesthetics, but I really want to connect that with the idea of self-care and then further bridge that into the overall theme of living in love. But before I dive into the physical aspects of living in love, self-care, whatnot, I really wanted to talk about the overall idea of self-care. As I mentioned, live in love, it talks about loving yourself, others, the world around you, whatnot. But how exactly can we do that? In my personal opinion, and I think most of you can probably agree with me, and it's been said so many times over and over, if you cannot love yourself, then you can't exert that with others or with the world around you. Let's get to the core. Let's get to the nitty gritty, the meat and potatoes. What exactly is self-care? Self-care looks so different for everyone. It could be getting your hair done, getting your nails done. It could be journaling, reading a book. It is so subjective and you can really personalize it to your own needs. Another saying that you've probably heard so many times, I'm probably going to sound like a broken record, but this is one of my favorite sayings that you cannot pour from an empty cup, okay? You need to make sure that you pour into yourself first so that you are prepped and ready to take on the world, to take care of others, to be there for others. Now figuring out what exactly it is that you like, what exactly helps you practice self-care can be extremely fun and fulfilling. And something that I've actively been doing is experimenting with different things, trying out new things, and seeing what exactly makes me happy, what I enjoy to do so that I can implement that within my everyday life. We're so used to the routine that we already have. Take a day out of the week, maybe even half a day if you're super busy, Take the time to do some research. There's nothing wrong with hopping on Google and searching up like, what are some new hobbies that I can do? And I know I keep saying it over and over again, but pour into yourself first, make sure you're okay. And then you can essentially 
live and love i'm very excited to launch this series i've always been so passionate and so into self-care and i really want to share that with you guys we will be dropping a new segment every wednesday so make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out the episodes in this series will talk about the different types of self-care and how to integrate that within your beauty routine so it will be divided into three episodes six three episodes one for hair one for makeup and one for skin our goal with this segment is to give you a new outlook on self-care and to see that there isn't selfishness in pampering yourself because um when it comes to physical beauty aesthetics everything on the outside that can often be seen as vain or seen as um being full of yourself almost so we want to get rid of that ideology normalize the idea of treating yourself, living in luxury, and essentially living in love. And to educate you on its importance while adding our own flair to it so that it makes it even more enjoyable. Okay, self-care, it doesn't need to be boring. It doesn't need to be this repetitive routine. It can be vibrant, it can be exciting, and it can be spontaneous. Be sure to stay tuned so you don't miss the series Self-Care by Chloré, and don't forget to like, comment, add, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you know whenever we post, and don't forget to spread love and inspire beauty.